What makes a seemingly ordinary man transform into a ruthless serial killer? Is it a troubled childhood, a dysfunctional family, or a deep-seated darkness within his soul? Today, we delve into the life and crimes of Richard Mark Edward Evanitz, a name that sent shivers down the spine of people in Spotsylvania County, Virginia. Born on July 29, 1963, Evanitz had a childhood marred by dysfunction. His family life was far from perfect, setting the stage for the darkness that would later consume him. The early signs of his deviant behavior manifested themselves in a conviction for indecent exposure, a crime that hinted at the sinister path he would eventually take. His life took an even darker turn after serving in the Navy. Once an individual who had pledged to protect and serve his country, Evanitz started a brutal campaign of violence and terror that would take the lives of at least three teenage girls in Spotsylvania County, Virginia. His first known victims were three young women, their lives brutally cut short in the name of his twisted desires. The terror he inflicted didn't stop at Virginia. Avonitz continued his reign of fear, abducting and raping a 15-year-old girl named Kara Robinson in Richland County, South Carolina. His crimes were not limited to these areas. Suspicion arose about his involvement in additional crimes, including the tragic murder of Sarah Cherry in Maine. His name became synonymous with fear, his actions painting a chilling portrait of a man who had lost all semblance of humanity. Yet, like all stories, Evanitz's tale of terror came to an end. The law finally caught up with him, but not in the way many would have expected. Cornered and overwhelmed by the magnitude of his crimes, Evanitz chose to end his life, committing suicide on June 27, 2002. The life and crimes of Richard Evanitz serve as a grim reminder of the darkness that can lurk within the human soul. His journey from a troubled child to a ruthless serial killer leaves us with chilling questions about the nature of evil and the factors that can push a person over the edge. In summary today we've explored the life of Richard Evanitz, born into a dysfunctional family and later serving in the Navy. We've followed his descent into criminal behavior, starting with a conviction for indecent exposure. We've recounted his brutal crimes, including the murder of at least three girls in Virginia and the abduction and rape of Kara Robinson in South Carolina. We've touched upon his suspected involvement in other crimes, such as the murder of Sarah Cherry in Maine. And finally, we've discussed his tragic end, committing suicide when cornered by the law. It's a tale that leaves us with more questions than answers, a chilling testament to the darkness that can hide within an ordinary man. But it's also a stark reminder of the importance of vigilance, of staying aware, and of the power of justice, however delayed it might be.